Reject. They're not making ghosts like they used to. Who else wants to try out for my Haunt Quarters crew? This is the last one, boss. Yeah. He calls himself Squint. Uh, excuse me, uh, but the name's not Squint, it's Squid. <laughs> Mr. Squid, and I will be valuable to you, Mr. Evil. And what value could you possibly be to me? I can capture the Ghostbusters. Even I can capture them. Throw him out! But your madness... Never mind. I'll throw this wimp out myself. <laughs> you call yourself valuable? Ha! I'll show you how valuable. But, but, but your madness... You, you, you didn't give me a chance! He didn't believe I'm valuable, but I am. I know I am. I'll show you how valuable I can be, Prime Evil. I'll capture the Ghostbusters, and after that, you'll beg me to join your gang. All right, this is the last one. Look! Wow, looks just like old Prime Evil. Real mean. Uh. Yeah, that's the best one yet. Hey, Tracy? <laughs> Tracy! <laughs> Come down from there, Tracy. Come on, it's only a shadow. <laughs> <laughs> and you thought it was the real thing. <laughs> Who could that be? Nobody there. Nobody here. Down here! I'm looking for my cousin. Belfry? My cousin? Here? Oh, my God! Oh, howdy, cuz! How you been? You said I could come visit you? And? Well, here I am. Come on in. Hey, fellas, this is my cousin Beauregard. He lives on a farm. Uh, uh, howdy, hi. Howdy, Mr. Ghostbusters. Oh, golly. Wait till the boys back home here about this. We see you fellas on the news all the time. There's Prime Evil. <laughs> <laughs> Just a shadow, Beauregard. Well, oh, I'll be hog tied. You sure fooled me. I thought it was the real Prime Evil. Oh, he's not so tough. I've seen him hundreds of times. Really? Oh, golly! Pull up a chair, Beauregard. Mind if I take off these heavy shoes? Uh, 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 please, Beauregard. Oh, not here. Uh, uh, why don't I show you around, cousin? Brace yourself, guys. I feel a call coming in. Uh, you're reaching those command, but it's late. I'm tired, and unless this is real urgent, buzz off! This is Jake. May I help you? Uh, yes, uh, this is Mr. Billingsley in the mansion up the hill. I'm giving a surprise party for my wife. I'd like the Ghostbusters to come as my guests of honor. Can you? Wow! Uh, I mean, yes, we'll be there! Now, don't forget, it's a surprise party. <laughs> and are they in for a surprise? We're going to a swanky surprise party, guys, and we're the guests of honor. Oh, boy, wait till Belfry hears about this. Golly! That building's higher than Possum Gulch. Ooh, and pretty, too. Oh, city folks never notice those things, Beauregard. For land sakes, you mean city folks build pretty things and never look at them? Uh, well, I mean, uh, yes, uh, I mean, no, I mean, uh, I mean, uh, Belfry! Gotta run now. I'll explain later. Oh. Golly! They sure move fast in the city. Hey! Wait for me! Hmm. I think your hat's too fancy. 
No, too flashy. Perfect. Uh, what's going on? We were invited to a swanky surprise party in our honor. Oh, a party? Wow! Oh, boy! We're going to a city hold Oops, forgot my shoes. As soon as Beauregard gets his shoes, we'll go. Uh, on second thought, you, you, you guys go on. I, I mean, we won't be going. What? It's not like you to turn down a party. You feel all right? Uh, I'm okay, but Beauregard's not really the party type. Well, if you really don't want to go... Hey, guys, what do you say we go in uniform? Why not? Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Go! Let's go! a good dream. Sorry, GB, but we're stepping out tonight to a party. Well, where's Belfry? He doesn't want to come. What? Belfry turning down a party? Well, in that case, I'll take his ice cream. <laughs> Ghostbusters in my crystal ball. You must stop them, Belfry. The party they are going to is a trap. They are in great danger. Whoa! All right, and thanks. I'll do what I can. We've got to do something, Beauregard. The guys are in danger. The party's a trap. Oh. Boy, oh boy, I bet this party's really something. Have you ever been in a mansion? No! Me neither. Inside, this deserted mansion is perfect for my trap, but it doesn't look perfect outside. I can fix that. Magic of the ocean, magic of the sea. Fiddle-dee-dum-dum, fiddle-dee-dee. That should do it. Ah, uh, just in time. I think I hear them. Wow, this mansion is classy. No cars. We must be the first ones to get here. You sure you got the right address, Jake? This place is creepy. It sure is. <laughs> Something tells me I'm not gonna like this party. That came from upstairs. Let's get out of here. Let's look upstairs and be ready for anything. I'm ready. Okie dokie. Did 
did you bring the dematerializer, Tracy? Did you, Tracy? Tracy? Eddie? So happy you accepted my invitation. Who are you? What have you done with my friends? I'm Mr. Squid, the clever, evil Mr. Squid. And as for your friends, you'll be joining them soon enough. <laughs> Enter the cellar with you, Ghostbuster. Tracy! Thanks, pal. I needed that. You guys okay? I'm fine. Okie dokie. A fine mess I got us into. This is some party. Uh, no, uh, no message. Uh, thank you. Oh, this is terrible. I can't reach Futura, and Jessica's out covering a story. Oh. Well, don't be a bad cat. I'll help you. <gasps> you mean you really want to help after the rotten way I treated you? That's what cousins are for. But uh, they're not your friends, Beauregard. Uh, why would you want to help them, huh? Cuz, they're your friends. But, uh, but... Well, time's a-wasting, cuz. Let's scoot on over and save your friends. And get those vomits a taste of bat power! <laughs> yeah, let's scoot over. But... I don't know where they went. Solid. Uh -huh. Solid. Solid. Hey, over here. Sounds like a hole. If we could only loosen one of these stones. Give me a hand. Hey, it's a tunnel. Nice work, Tracy. <laughs> Nothing like a delicate touch. Only one problem. What's that? This big hole in the wall will tell Mr. Squid how we got out. <laughs> That makes it worse. <laughs> All right. Now let's see where the tunnel goes. Uh, it's no use. I don't know how to find them. Hey, what about that thing you showed me in the obstatory? Obstatory? Oh, you mean the observatory. That's, uh, yeah. Maybe Skeletoscope can find him. Ooh. Let's see. Uh, this one is on, and uh, the, this one. Uh, are you authorized to do this? Who said that? I did. You're obviously new around here. Come on, Skeletoscope. This is important. Important. Going to the moon is important. You'll just have to stargaze some other time. This is my day off. Well, of course. And I'm sure you deserve a day off. And we're sorry to bother you, Mr. Skeletoscope. But Belfry here tells me you're just about the smartest critter in the world. In the universe. Oh, you really think so, Belfry? Well, well I... Ah, of course he does. Well, look. In a nutshell, the Ghostbusters are in a pickle. We don't know where they're that moose to. And we got to find them. Well, why didn't you say so? Flip on my microscope, though, for your third switch to the left. Ah, now turn the locator switch to zero. Aha! There's the ghost buggy. And the Ghostbusters must be in that mansion. Take a look here. Huh? You found it! Of course I did! Golly! Oh, thanks a heat, Mr. Skeletoscope. It was a pleasure meeting you! <laughs> Goodbye, little fella. I like your friend, Balfrey. He recognizes class. I'm sure Prime Evil will talk to me. You tell him I have very important news to give him. Sure you do, Mr. Squirt. Next you're gonna tell me you've captured the Ghostbusters. Yes, I have. How do you know that? <laughs> Hello? Hello? <laughs> 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 he hung up on me, that little... How do we get in? Well, why don't we knock? Huh? Who could that 
me. Hmm, maybe this place is haunted. Think we can squeeze in there? If in that dude finds us, we'll be in a tight of squeeze, cuz. Oh, too many corn fritters. Oh, we're in the cellar. We're in a jam. We're trapped. Uh -oh. Quick, cuz, in here. There's only one way to prove to Prime Evil I've captured. <laughs> Disappeared! Find anything, Tracy? <laughs> Shh! I think I hear something coming this way. Get out the dematerializer, Tracy. Okie dokie. Jake! Eddie! It's us! Oh, never mind. It's only Belfry. Belfry? And Beauregard! How'd you get in here? The question, Mr. Eddie, is how in heck do we all get out of here? We came to tell you this is a trap, but uh, I guess you know that already. <laughs> hey, Beauregard found it. They've got to be here somewhere. I must find them. I must capture them to show Prime Evil how smart I am. Ah, there they go downstairs. <laughs> Someone in that room. Got a flashlight, Mr. Eddie? Squeak! How dare you disturb me! Get out! Oh, oh, sorry, excellent one. Sorry to disturb you. But wait a minute. Why would Prime Evil be here? They tricked me. Well, I'll show them. So you thought you had me fooled? That's what you think, Squid. Keep your eye on the ball. Hit it, Tracy. <laughs> Don't zap him yet, Eddie. What did you expect to get out of capturing us? I wanted to prove to Prime Evil I was worthy of joining him. I tried really hard. It was very important to me. It's more important to be yourself, Mr. Squid. You shouldn't try to change yourself just to fit into a group. Yeah, especially Primeval's group. I guess you're right. But before you zap me, I have two questions. What are they? First, what magic did you use to copy Primeval? With Eddie's hands and my cousin Beauregard's voice. Show him how, cuz. This is how I did it. What's the second question? Are you gonna dematerialize me? You did some pretty rotten things. And when you do wrong, you have to answer for it. Next time we meet, I hope you're on the right track. I understand. Eddie? And when I come back, I'd, I'd like to join the Ghostbusters. Okay, everybody. We've got one more mission to accomplish. Oh, no. Well, what is it, Mr. Jake? We have to call up all our friends and show Beauregard what a real city hoedown is like. Golly! Then what are we waiting for? Let's go, 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 go Oh, hi, everybody. Belfry's going to tell you about today's story. When I saw how funny Beauregard was dressed and how funny he talked, I was too ashamed of him to take him to the party. Grown-ups call that prejudice. I call it stupid. So, please remember what I forgot. People should be judged by the way they act, not by the way they look. Uh, well, in other words, kids, don't judge a book by its cover. You hear?